the custom context menu in Bricks, which gives you quick access to various block actions. And we're just gonna start by editing our section. Normally, we would hover over our section and then at the bottom right, we can click this little pencil icon, which of course is a bit tedious and takes some time. So instead, what we can do by using the custom context menu, we can just hover over our section, click anywhere, and right click, and this brings up our context menu. So you can see here, we can edit our section like this. What we can also do, we can clone it. So let's clone it, scroll down, you see it cloned it with all the elements, all of my styling. Um, we can copy and paste styles, but this is something I'm going to show you in a second by uh, using these two elements. So let's just delete our section that we just copied. Okay, so we have two icon boxes here. They're already styled. You can see they have a different color than the default styling. I'm just going to add another one here. You can see this is the default styling and this is what we uh, styled um, already here. So. How do I accomplish the same styling for this new box? Of course, I can go in here and I can change all of my controls and my styling, but a much faster way to do this would just be to hover over our element, right click, and then we copy our icon box styles, right click, and then paste them. And you can see it only pasted our styles, style settings. So the content here, my heading, and also my text stay the same because that obviously we don't want to paste this is just about applying the styles to a different element and again this works for any block if you have uh, certain settings here in your column row or section you can just right click copy them and paste them into any other block okay but what also works here so let's say you know you have a template somewhere that has some styling applied to it that you would like to reuse then you can just open up this template like in my case here I right click, copy it, and then I can go into another browser tab. Um, this is another template that I created in a different tab. And then you can just hover over it. Let's just make sure we copied those styles. Hover over it, paste it, and now you can see I pasted my styles. Last feature that you can also do from here by right clicking, this only obviously works for elements. You can save this element as a global element. So I save this here. And if you scroll down, you can see now it's saved as a global element. There's a different Bricks Academy article that talks about global elements. I'm not going to cover this in this video. But yeah, I hope this gives you a good overview of what is possible and how much time you can actually save by utilizing this custom context menu feature. I use it all the time and I hope you will do the same.